Good morning. It is Monday, so that means Motivation Monday. Woo! Today's subject is hitting the restart button, and I've also got a special shout out to all my subscribers on my YouTube channel. Stay tuned. Welcome back, Jacob Bell, CEO of Build Enterprises. And today is a Motivation Monday segment. So every Monday, I take my pre-workout, I get ready to go, and I film just kind of like a short little, you know, clip to kind of fire people up during the weeks because I know it definitely helps me and hopefully it helps my over 300 subscribers now uh, on YouTube. So. So the restart button. So I actually worked with a really, really great company um, when I was going to school and I was uh, getting my master's degree and I was opening up my first few businesses um, quite some time ago. This was, I believe, started back in 2011. And the company had an amazing culture. I learned so much from the company. And, and that's actually one company that still, you know, some of the values that I learned from that company still resonate in my business practice today. <clears throat> and uh, and so they used to always say the restart button, right? So it was a, a car dealership that I worked for, but again, it was it was with Ford. And I'm a diehard Ford guy. I still am to this day. Um, but sales sales is a very difficult business to be in. But however, um, if you become good at sales, like a genuine salesperson, not like a uh, um, not like a, a predatory or a, a, an old school. Uh, old-fashioned uh, BS and car salesmen that you know that culture used to exist quite a quite a long time ago nowadays with the access of information and technology um, it's really kind of hard to BS your way uh, in the car business anymore but anyways um, that company every month your sales figures would reset right you know because you would do a, a monthly quota and every you know every new start to the month um, our speaker would be up there and and uh, would talk about how this was the restart button right or if you had a really really bad week or if you had a really really good week or a really bad month or a really good month there's always a restart button so i took that philosophy and i i do it every week. You restart button every week. Every Monday is a restart button. Every Monday, nothing else matters. What happened last week doesn't matter. Brand new week. What are you going to do? Right? You got a, you got a crap week. That sucks. But you know what? It doesn't matter anymore. It doesn't matter anymore. It's not even worth wasting your time anymore. You know, like for example, right? Trucking along, doing great with my channel. I uh, uh, update the web page, update a blog. I'm working on another company's website, another company's blog. A uh, whole bunch of social media. Like I was rocking last uh, last week. However, however. Life happens. I'm a new dad, so um, so there's some kid issues that were kind of thrown in the mix. And then I had my anniversary, my three year anniversary with my lovely uh, my lovely wife Angela, and um, so I had to put things on the back burner to go and spend some time with my wife and new mother Angela, and she's really kind of been, you know, she's been doing a lot more than I have for the kid. You know, she's really kind of stepped it up because I'm, I'm running these other, these other things and she's, you know, taking care of the kid. So, you know, she's, she's burned out, you know, because she's pulling more than her fair weight. So we decided to take some time. I took everything off of business. Um, no promotion. Um, I didn't do my Sunday stream like I typically do. Um, just everything just just was put on halt because she needed that time. We needed that time, you know. And and keeping the relationship alive um, is a is a big deal. So I decided to take off everything now doing so as a business owner, I mean, yeah, I got my passive residual income streams coming and still it doesn't matter what I do, you know, um, but it really just kind of halts progress on, on especially new projects, especially, you know, my new project here on YouTube as well. So, um, so that did set me back, you know, and then I, I come back and I was doing a little bit of work on Sunday, you know, just trying to put out, you know, fires that I, you know, that I needed to or whichever, but, um, but, you know, kind of craps you out a little bit because you, you, you know, or you have all this momentum, you have this stuff going, but then you have to, you know, it's the work life balance, right? So 
I had to, I, Angela needed that time. She deserved that time. And so that's what we did. You know, we, we took off and, and that was that. So now it's Monday. So it doesn't matter that, you know, I hit a wall. Everything basically just stopped in the world for me um, for the past couple of days. But now it's Monday, right? So restart button is hit. I'm here. I'm getting ready to, to crush it here in the gym. And, uh, and and get my week going and and get the steam going again and have it carry through through next weekend and next week and next weekend and next week and repeat and repeat and grow exponentially and that's that's really the goal when you build something new or you have a business you want you want that growth to compound on growth and you just want it to you just want it to go you know so again nothing else matters it's a new week it's a new Monday uh, it's early in the morning go out get your heart rate going get pumped up go train you know if you've got plans or if you've got projects or if you've got ambitions or dreams that you haven't started man it's a great it's a great way to start on a monday you know the only thing is better than a monday is a monday on a new month you know i because it's like new year's every month for me i love brand new months brand new mondays i mean i'm just like i'm ready to crush the world right so that's that's kind of my segment here um, on the restart button and, and starting up and, and just getting it going and get the momentum, you know, get the momentum on a Monday, you get things rolling, Tuesday's a little bit easier. By the, by toward the end of the end of the week, I mean, it should be full steam ahead, you know, and then if you work on Saturdays, which I typically do, um, you really got a lot going, you take a Sunday off, you get a little bit of a breather, you know, but then again, when you hit it back Monday again, things are already going, things are already turning, like you'll, you'll carry, you'll carry yourself out so I'd much rather just have one day off on a weekend and still have some momentum then take off two or three days you know like a lot of business owners give themselves three-day weekends all the time um, it's really kind of hard to pick back up because I mean it's almost half the week off right you know you're you're only working almost part-time in my opinion so um, again I hope this helps some of you out and then just to get on kind of a little bit of appreciation post as well um, my channel um, has broke 300 and I am now up to 6,000 views on YouTube. So my channel has been viewed 6,000 times in under two months. Um, and again, that for me, being an ugly dude and a new dude, um, you know, not a well-known personality by any means, um, that's a big deal for me. Uh, because I've got people, you know, that are that are hitting this channel, and my averages are are doing really well. Um, so hopefully, I'll get a little bit more of a breakout. I would love to hit ten thousand um, views by the end of the month, and I would love to. My goal is ten thousand views by the end of this month, and also I would like to break over five hundred subscribers. I'd love to break a thousand subscribers this month, and um, that's my goal because I would love to hit ten thousand by the end of the year. Um, but I definitely need some breakout content. So that is going to be on my agenda um, this week is to get a little bit of breakout content. Um, hopefully Trending Tuesday. I'm looking at a couple of different ideas for Trending Tuesday. I might do something a little bit different. I'm not 100% yet. Um, I'm going to kind of kick the idea with the wife, who's also my vice president, who's also my counsel. Um, so I'm going to get that going. Um, going to get my, you know, my, my blog. I'm putting on content every, uh, every day now. Uh, I'm looking at getting, um, I'm with Medium now. So I'm looking at uh, potentially going to partners with Medium as well to share content. So just got a lot of stuff going on. So again, to wrap up, man, hey, so it's, so it's Monday. Hit that restart button, that reset button. You know, get things going, get get the negativity out of your head. If you had a great week, awesome. It doesn't matter. What are you gonna do this week? Like like what what is gonna be great this week for you? And then if you had a really crappy week last week, doesn't matter. It's it's the it's the reset button. Today is a brand new day, brand new week. So what are you gonna do this week that that is that is gonna help you not only reach your goals? But what is also going to help you start something new, start a new project, or or excel or increase or enhance um, anything in particular you have going on, especially if you're a, you're a, a business owner or if you're self-employed, you know, like like what are you going to do to grow your empire? What are you going to do to to build your influence and build your aspirations and build your um, just build you, build your brand. You know, I mean, building your own brand is a very, very difficult thing. A lot of people don't appreciate the difficulty of building your own brand or, or building your own legacy 
um, in the world, especially with there's just, you know, there's so much saturation almost everywhere, you know, so you really, really have to have that desire. You really have to have that drive. You really have to have that sense of purpose and that sense of, of I'm not going to accept failure. Like I'm, I'm going to crush it. This is how I'm going to do it and have a plan, have a goal, write it down, you know, so you can see it and go, that's why I'm waking up every morning. That's why I'm doing this. You know, like there, there has to be a purpose behind it or you're just, you're just not going to do very well you know so anyways thank you so much for joining me here on motivation monday um it was kind of a kind of a little bit of a different one because i was kind of wrapping two things into one and also giving kind of um uh, my plans as well um on the week so you guys can join me on this beautiful thing we call life so again nothing else matters nothing last week matters good or bad what are you going to do this week what are you going to do to keep moving forward so, again, thank you for joining me, and I will see you guys later.